Hello, my friends. It's bedtime at the Keyport Library. We're back in the library. Um, and I hope we'll see you here soon. But I'm going to read you a book tonight called Dragons Love Tacos. I did not know about dragons and tacos. Um, this book is by Adam Rubin, and it's illustrated by Daniel Salmieri. And look at that picture. Sorry about the shine. <laughs> Dragon has so many tacos. So I guess I do love tacos. I just didn't know it. Here's the page with so many tacos. The title page. There you go. Tacos being served very elegantly. And here's the dedications. To my loving sister, Bruce, smart, beautiful, and full of laughter, A-R. And the other one is for Aaron, a wonderful friend. Thank you for everything, B-S. And look, there's the taco cave. This is where dragons get their tacos. Hey kid, did you know the dragons love tacos? They love beef tacos and chicken tacos. They love really big, gigantic tacos and tiny little baby tacos as well. Now who's talking to us? Hey kid. Well, it's this kid and his dog. They look a little bit mad, but maybe not. They love dragons though, right? Look at all the dragon stuff. Hey kid. All right. Why do dragons love tacos? Maybe it's the smell from the sizzling pan. Maybe it's the crunch of the crispy tortillas. Maybe it's a secret. Yeah. There you go. Somebody making tacos. You know all those ingredients, right? You ever make tacos? It's fun. Either way, if you want to make friends with a dragon, tacos are key. Hey, dragon. Why do you guys love tacos so much? There's the dragon getting his takeout. Okay, taco. <laughs> but wait. As much as dragons love tacos, they hate spicy salsa even more. They hate spicy green salsa, which I don't like, and spicy red salsa. They hate spicy chunky salsa and spicy smooth salsa. If the spicy, if, excuse me, if the salsa is spicy at all, that's hard to say, right? If the salsa is spicy at all, dragons, can't, they can't stand it. Look at there, he's in his dogs. They're looking at the salsa. Mm -hmm. You have to be very careful about the ingredients. No spicy salsa. Mm -mm. A Guide to Dragon Cuisine. That's the cookbook he's reading. Why do dragons hate spicy salsa? Well, just one drop of hot sauce makes a dragon's ears smoke. Just one single speck of hot pepper makes a dragon snort sparks. Spicy salsa, spicy salsa. <laughs> Gives dragon the tummy troubles, and when dragons get the tummy troubles, oh boy. So here we have a little bit of hot sauce, smoke coming out of the ears, pepper, little sparks. This could be big sparks. If you want to make tacos for dragons, keep the toppings mild. Tomatoes, check. Lettuce, check. Cheese, check. These are all good toppings for tacos and for dragons. See them? And that's the dragon giving us the thumbs up. Okay, so we know. Keep it simple, keep it mild. Hey dragon, how do you feel about spicy taco topping? It's another one, taco topping. Um, okay, let's see what he feels. Oh no, he's rubbing his tummy. Oh, I don't think he likes it. Do you? Let's see, that's his tail. Let's see what his face looks like. I think that's what he's saying. Does not like spicy. Okay, we get the message. Dragons love parties. I didn't know that. They like costume parties and pool parties. Look at the dragon. I think that one dressed up as a pirate. Very dashing. And look at there, they're in the pool, having fun. Look at the one, he's getting a few rays there. <laughs> they like big, gigantic parties with accordions. And tiny little parties with charades. Why do dragons love parties? Maybe it's the conversation. Maybe it's the dancing. Maybe it's the comforting sound of a good friend's laughter. Okay, here's that accordion bash. Look at them. And there they are playing charades. That looks like fun. They're having a good time. Dragons. 
the only thing dragons love more than parties or tacos is taco parties. Taco parties are parties with lots of tacos. Very good explanation. If you want to have some dragons over for a taco party, you'll need buckets of tacos. Pant loads, pant loads of tacos, okay. The best way to judge is to get a boat and fill the boat with tacos. That's about how many taco dragons need for a taco party. After all, dragons love tacos. Okay, there they are. Look at that boat filled to the brim with tacos. And they're still making more. And look at that dog helping. My dog would be eating those tacos. Dragons are not. Hey, dragon, are you excited for the big taco party? I think he is. Look, he's marketing on his calendar and circling it. He's going to be there. Just remember, dragons hate spicy salsa. Before you host your taco party with dragons, get rid of all the spicy salsa. In fact, bury the spicy salsa in the backyard so the dragons can't find it. This guy is very clever. I like him. He's cautious. Okay, so here's the dragons. They've come for the party. They're flying in. They're knocking at the door. They're peeking in the windows. And there's our friend and his dog burying the spicy salsa. There's going to be no problem whatsoever. These dragons love your taco party. They love the music. They love the decorations. They especially love the tacos. Congratulations. Oh my gosh, look at that party. Here's a guy with a lampshade on his head. One is juggling tacos. They're eating off his spikes. Everybody, I think, is having a wonderful time. Congratulations. Yes, indeed. It's a good thing you got rid of all that spike. Wait a second. What are those little green things in the salsa? You didn't read the fine print? Oh no. Look at, it says totally mild salsa, but you know what that tiny print says? Now with jalapeno peppers. And jalapeno peppers are very spicy. Dragons, listen to me, do not eat those tacos. Those little green specks in the salsa, those are jalapeno peppers. They are super spicy. I know you love tacos, dragons, but you are not gonna love these tacos. Do not let those dragons eat these tacos. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Oh no, they're already eating them. How can they be stopped? Oh no. See the tacos on his belly. <laughs> Too late. Oh guys, look what happened. Fire everywhere. Oh no. Too late, look at our guy. The dog are hiding under the table. Oh my goodness. Oh. oh no. And look at now. They burnt the whole house down. Yes, they did. And they look like they're very sorry about it, but the house is down. <laughs> Why would dragons help you rebuild your house? Hmm. Maybe they're good Samaritans. Maybe they feel bad for wrecking it. Maybe they're just in it for the taco breaks. <laughs> Look at them all helping. There's our friend showing them where to put the wood. They're nailing things in. Oh, yes, it's working very hard. And don't forget, there's the taco table. They get their breaks. I'm sure those are not spicy tacos. After all, dragons love tacos. Well, that's the end, my friends. I hope you have um, very pleasant dreams. I think I'm going to be dreaming about dragons or tacos, maybe spicy salsa. Thanks for joining us. Good night.